Hello everybody, this is Trevor Slescu, owner of Monster Hobbies, and today on this nice September day, we're going to be down taking a look at the River City Classics Antique Car Show. So without further ado, let's go and check out the cars. So here we have a World War II style Canadian Jeep. As you can see, it's even got the machine gun here. So here we have a 1964 Pontiac Acadian. This is a special built car by GM that was only available in Canada. As you can see the Maple Leafs on the image here, or on the emblem I should say. Uh, guy parked under the tree so you get a lot of leaves in there. This one originally was equipped with a 327, which I do believe is still the same engine, only hot rotted up. It's in nice shape. And then there we've got our interior as well. Looks like a convertible actually. So here we have the other Canadian car, the 67 Beaumont. Again, you can see the Maple Leafs in the emblem. My sister had a Beaumont, but hers was more like a the Chevy Nova for you guys in the States. But this is what we had up here in Canada. And as you can see, this is a nice example. Got a fully restored interior in here. And again, quite an amazing finish. Now I think the difference is though, our car had these gills in the side, and I don't think the American uh, Chevy had that. A nice B of Goodrich tires on it too. So here we have a 69 Beaumont, and again you can see the Pontiac type grill. Maybe this is 68, but it, it's uh, all Chevelle behind the grill, basically. There's our big motor in there. And of course, Super Duty 396, the nice interior in there. It's not too long after this time frame that uh, Canada stopped making the Beaumont. But still, very nice car overall. So here's a little car for you guys that are tuning in from overseas. Just so you can see Canada also gets some English cars. Here we got a Spitfire Mark IV. Not the one from Battle of Britain, but still pretty nice. With a nice interior in there. 1971. You can see all the nice detail here. A Triumph. Definitely a nice little restoration job on this. If it's been rest restored, that is. Might be original paint, who knows. How are you enjoying the video so far? Hit the like button to let us know. Here's a car for you guys that are lucky enough to get the Johan 1969 Rambler American. This is actually how it would look. Yeah, nice red on here. There's the Rambler hubcaps. As well as the seats that fold down backward. Got a CB radio in there. <laughs> yeah, very nice. Nice. 
see and then note the stock tail lights. So as you guys know in that Johan Rambler kit, it's supposed to be a 69, but this is the actual year of the real model. Here we've got a nice battleship gray 68 Camaro, the black stripe, big motor, and pretty fair pinstriping on it. A nice interior. Do you enjoy building model cars but have trouble finding them online? Well, you can visit our website at www.monster-hobbies.ca to see what kind of model cars that we have in store for you today. And don't forget to enter in the promo code YouTube to get some further savings. And now let's return back to the car show. Here's a pretty cool sectioning job on a 32 Ford. See how the uh, back of the trunk is in line with the top of the fenders here. Now check out this instrument cluster here. I stand corrected, this is a 28 Essex Super Coupe. Now my grandpa had an Essex coach back in the day. So here we have a 39 Ford done up in a 1990s style of uh, hot rodding. Here we've got a 56 Ford Sheriff Hot Rod Patrol car, an F100. It's a real cool one. Of course, AMT makes a 53, so you could, in fact, uh, recreate this thing using the AMT kit. But again, really nice work on there. Pretty cool. 
cool. So here we have a 63 Pontiac Grand Prix. Again, another one of the great GM mobiles. You can see the hard top roof on here. The nice interior and instrument panel, as well as those great wheels. And we just come around to the back here. So I think I'm gonna take a bunch of pictures. It's uh, starting to get into the copyrighted music phase the band playing down the street and uh, hard to get in between people to make a commentary so picture time nice car alarm Well, that pretty much wraps up the car show. There was so many cars out there, it was unbelievable, but we just didn't get enough time to film everything. So hopefully, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button. And what was your favorite car in the whole thing? Let us know down in the comments below. And until next time, everybody, happy model building.